Good afternoon. My name is Dr. Bailey, and I will be performing your cranial nerve exam today. So, as far as your general health goes, have you been feeling okay? Well, that's good. That's good to hear. Well, I want you to know that you are in good hands, okay? You really have nothing to be worried about. Don't be scared. Don't be alarmed. This is a very easy and painless test. Basically just testing your five senses. Hearing, smell, taste, sight, and feel. Okay? No particular order, but we'll get to them all and trust that you're in good hands. I want nothing but the best for you, okay? And I'll reassure you throughout this test just to let you know that you're doing a good job. Because it really is quite easy. Got it? Sound good? Perfect. Okay. First things first, really briefly, I want to get some information from you. Um, can you confirm your last name with me, please? Okay. So, wonderful. And your birthday. Good. And uh, last but not least, uh, what was your address again? What was the last word? Okay, thank you. Wonderful. All right, now I'm gonna go get my rubber gloves right back there, okay? And um, we'll get started with this test. Does that sound good? Good, okay, one second. So I'm going to check your lungs just to make sure that your breathing is uh, good, okay? Make sure you've got a nice, strong inhale, exhale, no issues there. And being based on the way you're talking and conversing with me, I think that you're probably just fine, okay? So don't be concerned at all. get my stethoscope put in here. And I'm going to go ahead and have you breathe in really deeply through your nose and exhale through your mouth, okay? So go ahead and do that for me. Good. And other side here. Go ahead and breathe in deeply for me. Very good. A couple more times. Breathe in. Good. And one more time here for me. Breathe in deeply. Wonderful job, my friend. Everything sounds perfect. Nothing to be concerned about at all. Okay. Now, what I want to do is... Uh, Take a quick listen to your lungs, okay? So, heart rate sounds fine. Let's go ahead and check out your breathing now. Deep breath in through your nose. I'm going to have you hold it at the top of your breath. And then we'll take a listen. Have you exhale. Okay, so on three, breathe in. One, two, three. Hold. And exhale. Fantastic job. You're doing wonderful. And one more time on that. One, two, three. Breathe in. Hold. And exhale. Okay. That 
is very good. I really don't hear anything to be concerned about. Your breathing sounds flawless as well as your heart rate, okay? Very strong, powerful heartbeat, and that's exactly what we're looking for. So, good job, my friend. Told you this would be easy. Okay, next, what I want to do is probably take a look at your eyes, okay? Now, are you able to see this chart over my shoulder here? Okay, it's a little blurry. Okay, well, I've got a handheld chart, and we'll bring that up, and it should be a little easier for you to see. Does that sound good? Okay. After we do this very basic chart test with our Snellen chart here, I'm also going to use my hands, okay, my fingers to uh, kind of test your peripheral vision. You're just going to follow my fingers up and down, left and right. Uh, and then I'll probably also want to get a little light and check closer into your cornea, your pupils, uh, sclera, all that good stuff around your eyes, just to make sure that your eye health, the general eye health is good. And then we'll proceed to our next portion. Does that sound good? Okay, perfect, wonderful. Let's go ahead and get our chart ready then. Wonderful, okay, now. Are you able to see this a little better than the one behind us? Good, okay, that's exactly what we're looking for. Really quickly, okay, could you read me the third line here? This one right here, and just read left to right. Good, okay. How about a couple lines down? Can you read this pretty well? D, H, J, B, and S. Good job. Great job, my friend. Your eyes are really good. How about this bottom line here? Can you read this line? This would be pretty impressive. L, yes. T. Can you read that letter? F, good. How about that letter? P, yes. And the last one? H. That's perfect. Good job, my friend. Now, can you tell me, just quickly to check to see if you have any issues with colors, okay? What color is this? Red, good job. And how about this color here? That would be green. Yes, yes, good job. Great job, my friend. So I don't see you having any issues with being able to read this basic Snellen chart, that tells me your eye vision is good enough for all intents and purposes for this test, so good job. Now, what I do want to do is take a quick look at your eyes, okay? The eye health, general eye health, and then we'll do our finger tests with peripheral vision and uh, tracking. Does that sound good? Good, perfect. All right, my friend, well, Let's go ahead and get our magnifying glass out here, okay? And I'm just gonna shine this in your eyes, this light, okay? Focus here on my nose. Thank you. Good. Good. Good job, my friend. Very good job. And that is looking good, 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 and let's see there, yeah. Wonderful. Your general eye health is looking really good. I don't see anything to be concerned about at all there. You do a really good job taking care of yourself, so again, good job. 
Now I do want to pull your lids up respectively just to check under the eyelids, okay? Check under, check below, on top, below, left and right eyes, okay? So again, just focus on my nose. Good. I'm going to pull up that left eyelid here. And that is looking very healthy, nice and pink, what we're looking for. No obstruction to the blood vessels or the veins or any redness to be concerned about. Let's go ahead and pull it down now here. Good. And again, nice and pink. Nothing to be concerned about there at all. So that's, that's good. Now we're going to pull up your right eye here. Eyelid. Excuse me. Take a look at that. Just keep looking at my nose. Thank you. And that eye is looking nice, pink, up by the blood vessels and the veins with the eyelid. Your sclera is looking nice and white, good and healthy, no bursted blood vessels or veins. I'm going to pull down your right eyelid here. And also looking very healthy. <sighs> Again. My friend, your eye health is looking immaculate, 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 immaculate. So good job there. Um, now, what I want to do is take a look at your ability to see how you're peripheral, okay? Essentially, just trying to figure out if your eyes are working in tandem with one another and your pupillary responses are the same between eye and eye, okay? So, what I want you to do here, okay, is let me know when my fingers enter your peripheral vision, okay? And this should be a very easy test. So just let me know when you see my fingers enter your peripheral. Good. And they look to be coming in roughly the same time. Good, okay. Good, okay. Good, okay. Good, good job. Wonderful job, my friend. How about diagonally? Good. 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 Good job, my friend. Now what I need you to do is let me know when my, when they leave your peripheral, okay? Good. 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 You're doing a wonderful job. Wonderful. That's fantastic, my friend. Really, really good job. Now, really quickly, before we move to our next portion, is I just need you to let me know which one of my fingers is wiggling, okay? Just point to it. Good. 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 Great job. And... Good. Fantastic work, my friend. You are doing a wonderful job. High five. Very impressive. Okay, now, what I want to do now is go ahead and move on to our hearing portion. And um, a lot of my patients find this very, very relaxing. Essentially, what I'll do is get a lot closer to you, okay? I'm going to whisper words into your ears respectively, and you just repeat the words back to me, okay? And I'm going to get gradually more and, and more quiet to see if your ears are working um, on the same level, okay? Um, then I'll move on to our tuning forks with two separate frequencies, and we'll do the same sort of test, okay? Great. Okay, so just repeat the words after me, okay? Red. Yes. Green. Yep. Purple. Yes. Violet. Yep. Okay, now I'm going to get a little more quiet. Okay. Vehicle. Good. Pa. 
even more quiet, okay? You ready? Okay, sounds good. Focus, yes. Football, yep. And now I'm gonna get last test here. Very quiet, almost unintangible. I just wanna see if you can pick up on the consonants, okay? If your ears are working the same that way. Sure thing. Well done. Okay. Your ears work just fine. I don't see anything to be concerned about. Typically, no one passes that last portion, so you're doing most better than most. Keep up the good work. See, I told you, you really got nothing to be worried about, okay? I'm going to take good care of you. Okay. All right. For this next portion, we're going to use our tuning forks, okay? Same test. Just let me know when you can't hear the tuning fork anymore. Okay. Good job. One more time in each ear. Here we go. job okay now we're gonna go ahead and use our other tuning fork here this one's gonna be just a little bit lower of a frequency okay but you should still be able to hear it just fine with how good your ears are okay here we go on this one yes much lower good job. Great. Very impressive. And now really quick, before we move on to the next portion of our test, I do want to just quickly give your ears a very quick cleaning. Does that sound good? Perfect. You're doing a great job so far. Now what I want to do, just to stay on top of your overall ear health, is have you, uh, just turn your head to the left or the right. I've got some signaling solution here, okay? And we will give your ears a quick cleaning. I've got some Q-tips. I'm just gonna spritz the tip of a Q-tip. Have you turn your head one way or the other? I'm gonna get in there with my Q-tip uh, and really get it cleaned out for you, okay? So let's go ahead and get our Q-tip ready.
we'll swap our, swap our Q-tip around and do the other ear. And by the way, your ear was very clean. I didn't see any debris or wax or anything like that, so you do a good job. Now, turn your head the other way, please. Good. And just getting in there really closely. Just good. Just stay put. Stay right there. Good. You're doing a good job. And just cleaning out any of that wax that we might see in there. Good job. And again, I don't see any wax at all. So, good job taking care of your ears. Really well done. Now, go ahead and put my stuff down. We'll move on to the next step of our test, that is. Now what we're gonna do is move on to the taste portion of this test. I've got three little vials here. You might do more than three depending on how you're doing on this, just to get a good overview on how your taste works. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a little dropper here. like that. Okay, I'll have you stick your tongue out. This is just a naturally flavored, and some artificially flavored, corn syrup that's going to carry flavor. And you just tell me what you taste when I put this on your tongue. Does that sound good? Perfect. All right, well, let's go ahead and get started. Just to make sure that the concentrate doesn't stick at the bottom. And we'll give you a little drop there on your tongue. And what do you taste with that one? Perfect, yes, that is coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Good job, my friend. Let's go ahead and get our next bottle here. that up. And again, you're doing a wonderful job. Very, very good job. Keep up the great work. Okay. And we'll drop, drop, drop on the tongue there. What do you taste with that? Yeah, that one's weird. That one is spinach. Spinach. Not the best, but some of our, you know, patients think it's kale, and it's not kale, it's spinach, so good job. And we'll go ahead and do a few more there, because that one was a little confusing. This is my personal favorite. tastes pretty good, to be honest. Our friendly doctor's examination pet, that would be Apache. He's a service dog to any patients that are feeling stressed. So if you want to pet him, feel free. Now we've got our next and our last flavor, okay. And this one is actually very, very good, and it's a tropical flavor. I'll give you a hint. It's an orange-colored tropical fruit, yes. And right off the bat, you'll know this one. Mango. Mango, 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 mango. Yep. Good job, my friend. So, 
you pass the taste tests with flying colors. So, so far, we've got eyes checked out, ears checked out, taste checked out. Now we're going to do the sense of smell, yes. And then we'll do the touching on the last portion to make up our five cranial nerves. So, again, same test. I've got a array of little vials like this. These are going to carry a smell each. Some are much stronger than others, but you should be able to guess them pretty easily, okay? Um, more of a sense, so think, um, well, you'll understand. So I'm just going to pop the top. And you just tell me what you smell, okay? It's a lavender fragrance. Yes, good job. Good job. Okay. Go ahead and put the lid back on this one. And we'll get our next one over here. you smell very strong yes that one is orange that one is orange good job my friend go ahead and put the lid back on this one good and we will get our next one out here and aren't around nature a lot. Don't guess that one correctly. Okay, and our very last one, and this is my favorite of them all. Mm, that one smells nice. Here it is. And what does that one smell like? Exactly like coffee. Coffee. Good job. Well done. See, I told you you had nothing to stress about. You've gotten every one of these tests perfectly. Every one of them you've passed with flying colors. Good job. Good job. Now, our very last one, and one of my favorites. Personally, I find this one relaxing when I receive cranial nerve exams. Is our face touching and the overall general feeling on your face. So what this is going to require me to do is get close, okay? And I'm just going to feel up under your neck, on your cheeks, and your forehead, um, as well as kind of around the nose and the eyes, generally overall around your face. Just let me know if any of this is ever uncomfortable uh, and let me know if there are any spots that you would be concerned about if I touch them and it's sensitive, okay? Perfect. Okay. Now I'm just going to come in and feel in your cheeks. And do you feel any discomfort on this side at all? Do you feel any discomfort?
you're doing a great job. So I don't feel any bumps or anything. Your left notes feel fine and your cheeks feel fine. So let's go ahead and check out that forehead and then we'll move to the other side, okay? So tap, 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 tap. Any discomfort at all there? No, good. Good, good, good. And just gonna feel around on your right side here. feel around your ear. Let me know if there's any, any of this is uncomfortable, okay? So we're going to feel in your right ear. Any of that uncomfortable at all? Good, okay, in your left ear. Excuse me, your right ear. I get confused. Please let me know, and I will make sure that you're well taken care of every time. Sure thing, my friend. Well, it was good to talk to you again. I hope all has been well with you, and we will see you next time for your next exam. Sure thing. Well, have a great day, my friend. Bye now.